Hey everyone, my name is Royce59, and welcome back to Watch Dogs Legion. Last episode, we um we kidnapped Witch and Malik, and now we're holding them hostage at our headquarters. And we're gonna see what we can do with that. Um, yeah, let's go. Last episode will be linked in the description, so you see all that going on. Ah, uh, always the restricted areas. That's different. Well, here I am. Neogate hasn't been around for long, but they're leading the antivirus market. I bet the Kellys have something to do with this growing success. Regardless, we're about to destroy all of it. <laughs> Listen, I want that as bad as you do. But let's gather all the evidence we can before blowing it up. This is what we've been chasing after this whole time. I suggest hacking the camera network to see what's what. That's kind of cool. It makes like a little wave when you hit the ground. It's kind of cool. Uh, okay. I know you want me to do that, but what the fuck with the camera? Oh. Oh, spider. There's a spider over here if I can get over there. Fuck. Okay, is there like a... So, where the fuck? Download that, okay. Okay, so so no. Uh, they're turning around too much, I can't go here. It's too dangerous. Back. Can I just... Damn. No. Oh, here we go. Fucking jackpot, holy shit. <coughs> Get up there! Okay. Got it. Okay. Uh, oh shit. I guess I go out here. What's over here? Oh, I have a visible club. Um. Shit. Go, 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 go. Someone in here? Oh, fuck. Someone is. Yeah, is he about to walk in here? Whew. Could it end badly? Alright. Let's see what we got. These feeds 
data from a sub basement under the server room. Anyone up for some light entertainment? You see, it contains a chemical cocktail. Botulinum, conotoxin, succin and choline. Well, why go on with the specifics if you wouldn't even understand? Let's just say it took a lot of trial and error to get the mix right. Wouldn't want the killing too quickly or contaminate the organ. Oh my god, this is where they implant the microchips. Test them. Bagley, capture all this footage. It's all going into my case file. Here's another. I'm glad to see they're trying to keep things sterile. Don't want to risk infection. One more. At issue are the strong convulsions triggered by the what microchips fuck? and concern over the possibility of damaging the valuable merchandise, the eyes being the most vulnerable. Initial findings indicate that the microcharge may be the problem. Although the damage to the lower stem is minimal, it is enough to trigger strong convulsions in a process. Uh, shut it off, Bagley. I've seen much too much already. Let's move on. All right. There's Damn. a special place in hell for all the people involved <laughs> in this operation. Oh, you got that You've right. got all the Golden Goose data along with this footage. Plus, you have her conspiring in the bombings. The, oh, I got the light side. Okay, I was going to get over. I hope so. Now, how about blowing that shit up and disabling those microchips? Lovely. Oh, wait, I'm not supposed to live. Fuck. This I'm supposed to get down here. Over here. I'm oh, gonna go in here now. Oh, fuck. Okay. Okay, so now it's actually just right down the stairs. I can I'll probably get my guy here. But now I need to shut off the power somehow. So I can actually get down here. Ain't that, wait, ain't that a thing in here? Thank you. Uh, hijack. Okay, maybe if I can sneak my way in, I might be able to. Son of a! Thinking of fucking see me. Okay. Nah. Not even gonna see me. Wait, don't I have a cloak? Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Yeah. I, oh, wait, I got this. I think I have a fucking idea. Don't I have a, um, invisibility cloak that I could just equip? Yeah. So I should be able to just walk past them. And just get in there. Fuck. Yeah. Hey, why didn't it? Why didn't it unhook? Why didn't it unhook? Why didn't it? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Why didn't it? Wait, 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 wait. Why didn't it? Okay, you know what? Run. Just, just run. Just, that'll be the best thing right now. Actually, I should be able to take these guys. Oh, bitch. I'm I'm going through the front door. This is not going so good. Hey. I'm fighting three guys. Ow, ow, okay, Jesus, this motherfucker. Okay, what? Well, just one. Just Oh god, he has a gun. What? Well, that went smoothly. Okay, let's try this again. Thank you. Time to put Mary Kelly's operation on ice. Let's blow some stuff up. Uh, okay, so now what do I do? Fucking course. Uh, is there a drone in there? Because I don't want, I don't think I can get in, be in there. Okay, seriously, why is my vibration on so much?
I begin on a fight. The microchips are no longer functioning. I think Kenny's golden goose is cooked. Not bad, Bagley, my man. Not bad at all. Just leave the area before the same thing happens to you. All right. I love this cloak. Okay, I have to move back. Hey, did else that stirred the hornet's nest. I suppose I got to get used to being on the run. Until you lose them, yes. Bagley has a certain charm about him. Bagley's kind of hard driving us down. down. I had them. Where did they go? Right. Terminating the search. We have enough, dead sec. Damn it. I'm going to my contact in the Attorney General's office right now. No time to waste. Mary Kelly is finally going down. Thanks. Don't let us down, Caitlin. Now what do we do? Aren't there still a lot of people with chips in them? Any second now, Mary Kelly is going to realize that her personal slaves are no longer slaves and more like potential witnesses. We should apprehend her before she turns them into definite corpses. We can't risk that happening. It might throw a spanner in Caitlin's plans. But we need to help those last few people she's threatening. The Kelly stronghold is at the sandstone residence. I've marked hmm. it on your map. Fuck, we're going to the stronghold now? Okay. Is it here? Oh, oh, fuck. This place? Oh, fuck. Okay. Mary's possibly going on a rampage of cleaning house. She still has control over the microchips in her vicinity. We need to disable them from her security system if we don't want all the help to die. Acknowledged. Okay, we need to locate the security zone. Probably gonna leave this here. No, I have to hold it. Okay. Is there like any cameras? Oh, there's a camera. Don't think there's a chance, do you? What, with them fighting back, rising up against their oppressors or some shite? Not likely. Ain't desperate enough, right? Might get desperate real fast if she starts in on them with that optic. Nah, she broke them. Got no will. She can shut them down one by one and they won't blink. Like cattle, right? I didn't cloak myself, so. <laughs> Alright, good. We got to the key code. Nice. Oh, I love the spider. This spider is practically invincible. When you find a route, <laughs> after like 35 minutes of looking, I need to find a way upstairs. I need I need to cloak myself again. Okay. So now, there's an elevator. Oh, fuck.
the fuck? Okay, so I'm supposed to get an old spider. Fuck yeah! <laughs> fuck yeah! Done. Are you seeing this? Alright. What the fuck? They're fighting back? Yo. Fucking hell. Right. Well, at least the chips are disabled. Mary has sealed herself in her office downstairs, but the mainframe will repower the elevator. Oh, and guards are on the lookout. So, do try to survive. Fucking great. Oh, okay. No one saw that. <laughs> Alright, so I need to get that myself. Unless I keep... I have to keep using the cloaking device. But the cloaking device won't Can I upgrade the cloaking device? So it'll last longer. Yep, close last longer when standing still or walking slowly. Thank you. Oh, fuck. Okay. Huh? So I need to work out a strategy here because it takes longer when standing still. So that's upgraded. That's fully upgraded. Maybe even distract this guy. First, wait, huh? It's not telling me to go to the elevator. It's telling me. You need to stay near the mainframe long enough so I can reactivate the lift to Mary's office. Oh, that's fucked. Bloody chicks don't work. I'm in my office. Come exterminate the vermin. Got it. Done. The elevators are operational and you can access Mary's office now. And Inspector Lau is on channel. None too happy, I'm afraid. DeadSec, what the hell are you doing over there? We had a deal. We do this my way. That's why we gathered all that proof. I have the paperwork we need. Is your paperwork going to stop her killing her slaves? The woman's a mad dog, Lau. We don't have time to fucking discuss this again. Get in there and stop her from doing anything drastic. I'm on my way. Okay, so now, see the elevator is on the stairs, so the stairs over here, right? This is on this door. I love how no one's gonna, I love how no one's questioning the fact that the doors are just open. Girl here, there's that girl there. I could kill if I wanted to, but... Which is a mafia because mafia you just called him over and then assassinated him. Dude, what did the helicopter? We just distract to go up here. And then they're kind of visible here. Didn't sneak my way. Together. Okay, I might, I might got this. I might. Oh, that was close. Yeah, out cold. I gotta do it when he's in there. Hmm. 
Hmm. Find the toss pots. No one here. Okay, they're looking for me, so I might need to do the invisible thing and just get straight into the elevator. This might go horribly wrong. I have no idea. I can't. I can't. No, I'm, I need to leave. Oh, I'm dead. Ow, bitch. Okay, this is way too many guys. Oh, pull, oh, yep, that's when I die. I pulled out my dumbass just pulled out a fucking gun. Guess what? What the hell of it? What? What? Woo! <laughs> I pulled out a fucking gun. I didn't mean to, man. Come on then. I don't need no fucking microchip to gut you filthy bastards. <laughs> Dead sick, is it? At least your timing's good. Cops are coming to take you in. Oh, I am counting on it, love. Everyone freeze. Back away from her. Mary Kelly, you're under arrest. Take me in, Inspector. I throw myself on the mercy of the bleeding court. I don't plan on me staying around very long. You lot! I gave you purpose when this city spit you out! We'll be seeing each other again very soon. Stop! You don't think she's gonna let you scum take her white whale? She's turning herself in. I know, it seems a little cliche to me. Who are you protecting? The system or the people? Promise us. Promise us. She won't go free. Can't do it. Oh, fuck. Go. I'll take care of this. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 Jesus. Okay. Man, she's dead. Damn. I'm not gonna lie, she fucking deserved it. Like, damn. Well, dead sec, you got your wish. Mary won't be walking away from this or anything else. I wanted to do this the right way, but after everything I've seen, I... Uh, I guess I couldn't let her live. She had it coming, Lau. And it's all she deserved. For the lives she destroyed. For Angel. You did the right thing. Damn right. Treated people like animals. She got slaughtered like one. I'm just glad she can't put any more people through this shit. I don't know. That was some version of justice, but not mine. At least... I didn't think it was, when we started all of this. Well, the Queen may be dead, but there are plenty of Damn it. and Kelly peons willing to take up the mantle. You're right about that, Bagley. I will keep my ear to the ground. I hear about more Clan Kelly shenanigans, you'll be the first to know. You're good partners, dead sec. Let's keep it going. Alright, so now... That makes three? Yeah, we have two more. We have two more to go. Alright, 
Oh, now we're going out to Albion. Where the fuck are you going? Jesus Christ. You'll like this. Got word from Hamish that Nigel Cass is planning to unveil some new nasty project at a press conference. Why would yeah. I like that? Albion's always... Because Hamish has convinced his Albion contact to talk to us. Apparently it took some doing since Radu's a squirrely sort. He's been especially agitated lately. But he has insider information we could use. The meeting's at the Drowning Post. Wouldn't mind a drink while we plan out to give Nigel bloody Cass a black eye. What the? <laughs> Come on, man. This ain't Greta Fado. Over here. Wrong way. What the fuck was that? Jesus Christ. Stay on your feet, damn it. This is the place. Where's our informant? Bad news from Hamish. His contact is running late. May as well make yourself comfortable. Impairing our frontal lobe again, are we? You watch me while I sleep too, Bagley. The attack occurred just as Albion CEO Nigel Cass was announcing a new security... Turn up the telly, mate! Our cameras captured video of the attack, which some viewers may find disturbing. Without their tireless work, we couldn't have rolled out these checkpoints. Watch out! 43C. Engage contact right. Aim fire! Aim fire! Government officials have yet to issue a statement, but Cass had this to say. An attack on me and my men is one thing. We're trained to handle these monsters. But I will not abide civilian casualties. This city deserves peace. And I promise you, London, we carry on as we are. These attacks will continue. But we don't need to live like this. I don't Scared understand you say that, but homes. you beat the... F Criminals. I don't understand you. Terrorists uh like these. To be stopped before they even start. And I have a plan to do just that. Your police and politicians may have stopped fighting for you. But I will never stop. Thank you. This is what I'm talking about. Cass ought to be in charge of things. The hell he should. He's just another greedy bastard. Nigel Cass is the only one who gives a fuck about this city. Twat. Oi, break it up. Keep it civil. Unbelievable. Fucking hell. Tell me you lot met with my contact and he had nothing to do with this. Your man never showed up, Hamish. But come on, this was a show. It has Cass written all over it. Of course. It played right into his hands. Control the narrative, right? I bet we'll find proof at the site. No, no, you don't get it, fam. Radu's been seriously unbalanced lately. Talking all sorts of rubbish about someone having to stop Cass, no matter the cost. Timing's too pat. Cass announces this new security initiative and then he's attacked in public. No way. Hope you're right. And it's not Radu gone off the deep end. Alright. Now, of course, they just. I'll say just. Of course, this is restricted. So, no one's allowed here? This is the site where Nigel Cass was attacked. But, surprise, surprise, his personal goon squad has already scrubbed the area for evidence. Unbelievable. He's putting a blindfold on us, covering up his dirty deed. Yes, if you search for clues, I may be able to reconstruct the attack in augmented reality. Ah, oh, you've got more angles than a protractor, Bags. There is a CTOS data relay nearby. That will have the data I need. Of course. Easy peasy. Mm. Please, exercise caution and report all suspicious activity to Albion. Don't let the TT get away. Don't perform a search. Reconstruct the scene in augmented reality. I know, but hold up. More information will be shared as it becomes available. Let me 
Ich auch. Ja, das packen wir es auf. So many people, I can't. This does look like pro terrorism in the sense that it's both professional and in favor of terrorism. Okay. Right, so he could be a pro. Doesn't really narrow it down, does it? I'll go have a look see. facial recognition databases and here he is Radu Florin an Albion employee in good standing until he tried to drive an exploding truck into his boss <laughs> Radu? Oh shit Fam, that's the bloke put me on the Themis my contact inside Albion I see I suppose with the number of enemies Cass has made there's no need to fake an assassination attempt what the fuck did he find to make him desperate enough to do this roll it bugs Look at that. Albion trucks with black boxes on the undercarriage, just like aeroplanes. Okay, so what else do I want me to do? I look up again. He found something. Could it be a more fucked up than Clan Kelly? Probably not. But I'll be shocked if it is. Well, that was one fucked up man. Oh. I can track down the black box, which should lead us to the truck's current location. Couldn't we also run the truck's license plates? Of course. I'll also monitor Albion communications and a thousand other little things you would appreciate. Looks like a disgruntled employee situation. Cass did something to seriously piss this guy off. That might be a good thing. We can exploit any sort of dissension in the Albion ranks. But let's make sure we're right. We need a better look at that truck. According to Albion radio chatter, they've moved the truck to the Tone bombing site. And here's something even stranger. They've moved Radu Florin's body along with it. Now, why on earth would they move it to the Tone site? Albion has been coordinating recovery efforts at the site, which is rather vague. It's a dumping ground, innit? For problems they like to see disappear. If we find the truck, we find Radu. Too right. Oh, fuck, okay. I've arrived at the Tone bombing site. Are we sure this is where Albion stashed the truck from the Finsby attack? That's right, but what we don't know is why they brought it here. I'll go have a look-see. Oh, what the fuck? What was that bus down now for? Okay. It's kind of weird coming back here. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to make it that. Make that. I might be able to make that. I'm dumb. I'm dumb! I'm good.
Well, the pot is here. This is the truck used in the Finsbury attack. I have a bin and plate match. The dash cam is a shambles, but the local cameras picked up some audio. Worth a listen. Jesus, he's pretty burnt up. Happens when your truck explodes. Fuck, I used to see him around R&D. Did you know him? Hell no. But even if I did, I wouldn't fucking talk about it. Know what I mean? I'm detecting several optics nearby with no life signs connected. That's where we should look for the driver's body. Going in. Oh, fuck. Okay, I went too far. Oh, fuck. Man. Juan, what are you doing? I have to be in my... This literal rotter is nearly dust. The attacker couldn't have decomposed this quickly. Yes, from the state of decay, I'd say this person died... Oh, right around the tone bombing. So that's one mystery solved. Damn! Fucking stairs. Okay. That guy blocking this one too. Is there? Is one blocking this one? This fucking work. Badly charred. No rot smell. I think this is our attacker. There's a lump of damaged metal in his noggin that might once have been an optic. But you can work wonders. Right, Bags? I'm pulling everything down from his cloud storage now. I recommend escaping from the premises. So, this is where I can expect to end up if I piss off Albion. If you consider that new bodies are constantly being unearthed from the tone wreckage, they can kill anyone they want and get away with it. Damn. I've decrypted an audio file recovered from the attacker's body. Shall I play it? Bagley, make me proud. He's launched them, Mum. They're waiting up there, and no one knows. People think he'll keep them safe, but that's not what he wants. He wants control. He sent them up there to watch us. And worse, he called them Justice Demis drones. What a cruel joke. The project was dead. But he has the team re-engineering an upgrade that'll activate a systemic reboot, and... You always hated it when I used my big up words. I... I can't let it happen. And without him, it doesn't. Mom, I'm about to do something. Something awful. Or at least people will say it's awful. If they know what I know, maybe they'd think better of me. Less of a monster. But I'm trying to stop a monster, Mom. I am. If you had the chance to stop something terrible from happening by... by... killing someone, wouldn't you do it? Something truly horrible. I'm sorry. I love you. Damn. Oh, he said I was in the air. Jesus. Oh dear. The Themis drones are already launched. All they're waiting for is a patch that tells them to activate. What a nasty business. Might take months, but Cass could get the project back on its legs. Unless we destroy the drones themselves. Bats boy, the Themis data we wiped at Titus. Any chance you remember enough to retro engineer a more suitable upgrade? I'll do you one better. I can code a virus from the data itself. Excuse me, Bagley. You held on to the super scary Themis project data? I asked him to. No sense in just flushing data. Never know what might come in handy or what you might learn. So, how do we use it to infect the drones? Albion's got a primary communications hub at Tower Bridge. Upload the virus there, fam, and all the drones get a dose. Let's do it. 
I didn't skip the other one, which I already did. Albion's primary communications hub, but there's more security here than there is around the Royal Meth Stash. You should start by destroying their encryptors. If your hacking skills are up to snuff, dominating a combat drone or two could help. Got it. I don't think I'm supposed to be over here, am I? I don't have people walking. I'm supposed to be under that. Okay. Okay, I need to get, I need to get in there. How the fuck did it? What the? Now they want me to get there. Let's check over here. Feels like a ladder or something. Bingo. Okay, that was. Okay, that's looks about the way I guess. Huh. Where is it taking me? I have no fucking idea. Uh. It's taking me in a window. Oh shit, okay. I'm staying right here. I'm still under the bush, so we can't really see me. I'm bringing a spider in there. Now, at least I can okay, now get to the front, front door, but I wonder if. This one just like this. Just still this, this. That was dumb! That's it for the encryptors. You can now upload the virus using the central antenna. Got it. We're off to the races. I'm reading incoming drones. Please, not Themis. No, no, no. These aren't the algorithmically driven assassin drones. They're just the normal drones that also kill you. I know it's big and intimidating as antennas go, but you have to stay close to it for the virus upload to work. Beautiful. The upload's about half done. Sure, sure. Take your bloody time. I'm fine. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, they're freaking out right now. Almost poetic. Oh, gosh. That's it for Themis, fam. No coming back from this. Yes, the lights are lovely. I suggest you leave before someone gets the bright idea to turn yours off. <laughs> uh, let's get out of here. Cassie's plan to use drones driven by some social algorithm to dispense justice has backfired. Do you think he's actually read any of those Greek myths he's named his drones after? What's to stop the next plan, and the one after that? Cass is the real problem here. We have to figure out a way to stop him. Nigel Cass has enough soldiers and weaponry to make Churchill wet himself. 
He has the public on his side, and he has us painted as terrorists. I'm afraid us going straight after him won't change any of that. So we take the people's support away, fam? Bags and me have some thoughts on what we gotta do. You lot better come in for a briefing. Alright, time for a briefing. Albion confirms that the explosions seen in the skies over London were indeed an Albion drone project that was sabotaged by the DedSec insurgency. In an exclusive interview with GBB Radio 1, Albion founder and CEO Nigel Cass had this to say. Truth is, the supposed freedom fighters of DedSec have made London less free. That drone project was meant to replace Albion boots on the ground, let the city get back to normal. But now, I can't in good conscience stand my people down. That's not how I lead. Cass went on to implore listeners to treat any suspected dead sec operatives as terrorists and to immediately report them to Albion. Oh, Cass is good. He spends his entire career killing anyone he sees as the enemy. And then when they strike back, he cries like a little boy. And it's working. Sorry, that was too cheerful. Sadly, it's working. Too <laughs> it's what he does. Scares the shit out of people, then swoops in and plays the hero. We've got to show them what he really is. So that's his weakness, his image. If we shatter that, he falls apart. Actually, a few of us cooked up a scheme that could help. Bagley. This is Claire Waters, political dissident and podcaster, reported missing after teasing a salacious upcoming episode. Sadly, it never aired. So all we have is this. On the next episode of Buccaneer Radio, I'm chatting with someone from deep inside Nigel Cass's inner circle. He's promised me something that will expose Cass as the tyrant I know he is. This is going to blow the roof right off White Tower. See you next week, pirates. Nigel would have spun that interview if it was spinnable. If he went after Waters for it, that tape's a smoking gun. We've got to have it. Claire was known to broadcast out of Freight One. You should begin searching there. Interesting. Claire Waters appears to be an equal opportunity muckslinger. Albion is her target of choice, but she's railed against tech genius Sky Larson, SIRS, and Plan Kelly. Opinionated, isn't she? I think an alliance is in order. We give her intelligence, and she gives our cause a signal boost. She's been digging in Cass's shit for a while. If what she has isn't enough to squeeze his bollocks in a vice, then maybe she'll join you lot and help find something. Alright guys, that's gonna be it for today. Lost Lost Legion Part 13, and it just keeps going. <laughs> oh man, I've been playing this game for a long fucking time. This game is long, like damn. Um, but now... We um we defeated Clan Kelly. She died, the way that she is gruesome, like the person she was. Uh, fuck, fuck that bitch. Seriously. <laughs> um, now we're going out to Nigel Class, Class, Cass. Then it's zero day, the last people. So we're getting really close to the ending. We're actually getting pretty close to the ending. There's only two more people left. And then it was what five. Now we exit out three. And now there's only two more. So we're getting really close. And, um, now we're gonna help to get partner up with this girl. We're gonna see what happens. We're gonna see... We're gonna give up the recording. We're gonna see what that girl is talking about. And see if we can bring him down. If not, I don't know. Because it must have been really bad if he stopped it from airing. And he's doing something to how he pissed the guy off that much. To try to just kill him in front of everyone. Like, he... He's doing something. Thing... It's getting interesting right now. It really is. Dude, I was so stupid at the beginning. Dude, I was, that was so stupid. I went to... I fucking pulled out my gun. They were doing fine. I pulled out my gun. Then they started shooting me. I meant to the others, though. <laughs> uh, now we gotta see what's going on with Nigel Cass and why the fuck he's... Has people just blowing up cars to assassinate his ass. See what the fuck he's hiding. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna see what that's all about. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today. Like, subscribe, and see ya.